just a couple years ago, five St. Louisans were drafted to the NHL. So that's pretty exciting for our city, and hopefully that'll continue to grow. And what I love to see is more little girls playing hockey, because that really wasn't a thing when I was little. And now there are, you know, little girl teams of hockey, so that's pretty exciting. So this is the All packaging right. you look for. Okay. Okay, so it's white cheddar and hot. Yeah, we just had Listerine strips before we... Why are you telling our secrets? We didn't want our... Why are you telling our secrets? <laughs> our uh, our guest... Earlier you mentioned, you know, kind of being under that umbrella of country music, and you said you almost didn't record the dance because you thought it wasn't yes. country enough. So what is it like for you now when country radio is kind of gearing towards that pop country feel? Yeah, I think... When you came out, you were the kind of guy who ran around the stage mm -hmm. and poured water on yourself and all the other guys kind of just stood there and played. So do you keep trying to up yourself as it goes along? No. Everybody is typing in with their Go Webster or Go Kirkwood. You know, Webster does lead this series 53-45-5. There was eight games where they weren't played. And Webster has won five games in a row three times. <laughs> So when were you thinking about this? Like, um, and right how many drugs were you on? And this was going <laughs> no, on your head. I mean, so you've said a little bit about the rap thing in country music, but then you have the spoken word. What's not rapping? A 10-day road trip featuring two all-star performances from Blake Snell. Snellzilla tossed for 11 and two-thirds innings, allowing only four hits, no earned runs, and striking out 19. Now we're back in town tonight, 4-7, and featuring a few new faces. Jake Bowers and Diego Castillo recently called up from Triple A Durham. And there's more than baseball going on here this week at Tropicana Field. Cardinals home opener is like the unofficial holiday here in St. Louis, which is always amazing. And this time, I mean, this is the first time in a long time that the Cardinals home opener is actually the home opener of baseball altogether. So we are in for a treat tonight and especially against the World Series champ. It's amazing keeping him one of the longest current players at one organization, which you got to love it. Everybody in Cardinals Nation loves the app. Okay. So, uh, ready? Uh, yeah. yeah. Okay. How many cups of coffee do you drink per day? Zero. I don't like coffee. I'm sorry. Are we not friends now? <laughs> I'm just so confused. I, yeah, I'm not a coffee You're person. one of those. Oh, that's okay. I'm going to try not to judge. <laughs> okay. okay. You're judging. I can no, see I'm it. not judging. I Angela Sharp standing by with one of the greats. I am so excited about this interview. Mr. Adam Oates is right here with me. You guys only really played together for, what, two and a half years. But for us Blues fans, it, it felt like forever. Was it weird when you left here and left Hall? And you've got a lot of great accomplishments. You've got over a thousand assists, which is really cool. Do you like kind of being that setup man? Yeah. That's right, I'm down here on the sidelines. You know, McClure South Berkeley is five and two, taking on undefeated Cardinal Rittner. And what you might have not known is while the teams were warming up, they played good old rap music from McClure South, and they played things like Flight of the Bumblebee for Cardinal Ritter, but it doesn't seem to be slowing them down as they are leading 12 to zero. Of course. Of course. All right. Don't well, you like that? Because every choice like you make can affect the outcome yeah. of the rest of your well, life. And what you're doing now is yeah. who you are. Yeah, and it's going to set you up for what you're going to be. Oh, well. All right. Getting deep. <laughs> I love it. I love it. All right, you guys, the month of April is coming to an end. But for our trivia, do you know what the word April means? All right, now this means he's in charge of keeping all the animals that are going to be here healthy, happy, and most importantly, alive, right? I mentioned that there's a lot of requirements you have to stay within to try to keep the essence of the train station back from the 1800s. That's the traits the Rays had. Now, of course, Wilson Ramos was traded to the Phillies, but I want to start with the one that I'm most excited about. A couple of minor leaguers to the St. Louis Cardinals for outspoken outfielder Tommy Pham, and plus, the Rays will have control for three years. Yeah. Keith Urban is an awesome guitar player, and he's going to get to show another side of himself when he joins blues great Buddy Guy on one of Buddy's tracks. But right now, let's keep it country with Cop Car. I sure would love to play this night again, so I think that is the perfect dance Play it again, Luke Bryan. Another experience with me. If it wasn't for them, look at my dad right here. That's your dad? I'm standing up on the truck? Oh, that's it. He's loving it. So if it wasn't for my mom and dad, I wouldn't be in St. Louis today. I love that. That's so heartfelt. And you hear all the fans yelling and cheering for you. Hey, dad. Hi. Good. How are you? Good. So I just interviewed Joel. He said without you guys, you know, he wouldn't be here. What does this moment mean for mom and dad? So he says you helped him with the comedy. Did he help you with the action? Uh, he did, well, sort of. Caught up with the man of the hour right here, Nelly. Tell us a little bit about the black and white ball. This is the sixth year you've done this. I also heard a rumor that you had a workout video happening. <laughs> Welcome.
Welcome to St. Louis Country. I'm your host, Angela Sharp. Weekend on 92.3 WIL. Kind of losing my voice a little bit. We've had quite the weekend. Zach Brown Band and Eric Church. And I've got another great night for you right here. We have videos. We have dancing and a lot of country fun. We're going to take it where all the magic happens right there on the dance floor. Brad Paisley, Riverbank. Chevy Dealers Artist of the Week. I gave you a little hint. He's nominated for a CMA in his video. I hope you get lonely. It's Cole Swindon. Better kisser, uh, Leah or Will Smith? She's probably the better kisser, but Will is a little more aggressive. He's a little more aggressive, yeah, is he? Yeah. Well, speaking of aggressive, now some of your friends, the St. Louis Blues, walk the red carpet before you, yes. and I have this photo of you in a Blackhawks jersey. I know. Well, let me just say something. Okay, you better explain this to us. As the leading goal scorer, are you taking that upon yourself, knowing that you have to kind of keep pumping up this team? Hey, Rays fans, Angela Sharp here at Tropicana Field. The boys are back in town after a seven-game road. There are plenty of great giveaways as homestand and even better baseball. We want to see you here at Tropicana Field. And don't forget, vote Rays. Another great matchup is the Nashville Predators versus the Jets. Now, they played game two last night and went into two overtimes before Nashville won. That series is now also tied 1-1 and they'll pick it back up tomorrow night. You heard a lot of Cam Yancey. His dad, Latrell Yancey, actually still holds the running yards record here at Webster, and he graduated in 1997. Back to you guys. Really comic books. And comic books are actually making a trend in schools. Granted, they're called graphic novels now, but they're in schools. And I got to go check out Emerald City Comics and find out what's hot right now in all the comic book world. Freaking sweet. Uh, they're people that we have a lot of fun with. And you're quite the professional. Reeves is over here throwing everything he's got at you. Is it fun for you guys to get out and about like this? Season, the way they ended the first, you know they won their last 14 of 15 games right here in Tropicana Field. And I hope you were checking out the 89th annual All-Star Game. Now, I know that uh, your fans are trying to vote for you again for Hottest Bachelor for the Country Weekly. Are you still a bachelor? I All right, so tell me, is there any crazy weird stories about women trying to get your attention? After that half, what adjustments are we going to make? We, we got to stop the run defensively. Uh, we did a good job earlier. But we kept making them snap the ball, but we didn't do it good enough. We got to make sure we continue to do that. And we found some things that we can do offensively. We just got to make sure that we're executing in the second half and come out here and do our job so that we can uh, turn this game around. And you're going to turn this game around, right? That's always the plan. If you're not in it to fight, you shouldn't be in it, and we're in it to fight. I love it. Good luck to you, Coach. Thank you. Back to you, Harry and Isaac. Hi, Angela. Hey, Dana and Anthony. How you guys doing? You know, it's a beautiful day out here in Belleville, and they made it even prettier with all the art they brought for Art on the Square. So I'm pretty excited here. I Thanks for joining us for C Players Now. We have some unbelievable student athletes to highlight on today's show. But first, I have to introduce you to the studio squad. We have Ray Merriweather here with us, longtime. 